Welcome back. So, my exams officially start tomorrow. I'm so unprepared, it is literally um, quite concerning. I had a video idea, which was probably the bad, the worst time to have a video idea, um, quite frankly. I was doing maths the other day, because as you know, I absolutely love maths, you know, it's just it's my favourite subject, like, just like getting frustrated over maths problems really turns me on. And I just talked to myself as a coping mechanism and I thought maybe I could film it. Don't know why. <laughs> I'm also really tired, so... So, basically how my studying works is I separate the subjects into half an hour slots. Right now I'm gonna do half an hour. <laughs> I don't really want to. Do I really? Should I? Do I really want to? I'm gonna do half an hour of maths, mainly for your viewing pleasure because it's really frustrating for me. It's, I think it's one of my worst subjects aside from history. So yeah, let's get on with it. <laughs> so I'm gonna go set my timer for half an hour and get my stuff because I still haven't got my stuff out of my bag because I'm really unorganized. Also the window's open so this is gonna look really weird, but whatever. <laughs> awkward moment when you can't find your math stuff Ugh. okay so what's on the agenda today that's all I really don't want to do circle geometry because it's fucking This is grade 8 shit. Fuck it, I'm not doing circle geometry, it's too hard. And I can't be bothered. Give me something that's easy. Bearings? That doesn't look very easy either, but since when is, has maths ever been easy? If you like maths, then I don't understand you. Please get out of my life. Where is bearings? Because I'm fucking looking for it. It is literally not here. These revision books are really expensive. Can I just add, like, yeah. This video has already been going on for eight minutes and I have achieved nothing. Well, that's kind of annoying. Bearing! <laughs> it didn't actually say it was in the index. So, um, I'm suing whoever made these books. Okay, I've got this. I can do this. I say with hesitation. I don't get why... <sighs> do I need a protractor for this? I haven't got a protractor. Oh, I do. I actually have a protractor. Can you believe that? I'm actually shook. Now, how to use it is something I don't know. I'm going to study music. Why the fuck do I need maths? I don't think, I, I don't think I'm reading the question properly, like I just, my brain is numb right now. Right, okay, I'm gonna read it out loud to you guys. Two ships leave a port at the same time. Ship A travels due west for 40 kilometers. Oh, I get it. That's actually quite easy. I'm actually doing something. I just did something. On a bearing of 110 degrees. I don't know what that means. What does that mean? This is grade three. I'm actually fucked. This is grade three shit. It's okay, but I could totally lose them. So now I'm presuming we... Actually, I don't know what... Oh, okay. 60 kilometers on a bearing of 110 degrees. So... That doesn't look right though. This is grade three. Oh my god, I'm so fucking dumb. Okay, now we need to measure the bearing. How the fuck do I do that? Wait, what? Where does that go? I am genuinely confused. Oh, oh, 
Oh, okay. I say O, oh, but like, I'm still confused. 160 degrees, apparently. How the fuck do you calculate a bearing? It ain't showing me nothing. I'm so tempted right now because the answers are in the back of this book. But I don't want to cheat. Will I really learn anything if I don't cheat though? It's better to cheat than to not. Actually, don't take my advice there, actually. I got it wrong and I don't know how. But, okay, fine. I got I got one A right. I didn't get one beat right though, so uh, that's a bit of a um, concern. Why did Miss sign me up for hire? You know, she's like, oh yeah, you can you can do hire. Yeah, you can totally do hire, you know? What? I'm already tired. It is literally 160, but I don't get why the book is saying otherwise. Because it is literally 160. I'm only missing something. I'm on the first question. What? I'm right. This book is wrong. I'm moving on. I'm moving on to the next question. I don't get that one. It doesn't tell me the right answer. It just, it's wrong. I'm really not a good role model, am I? Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Hello? Hi. Yes. Pardon? Nope. All right. Bye. A walker hikes from village A, which is there, from bearing of 35 degrees. Um, is it clockwise or is it anti-clockwise? Are they gonna tell me? I just wanna go watch Yuri on Ice and cry over my film notice again. So I did that right. Flex. That was easy. That was a lot easier than that previous one. And I spent ages on that, so um, I'm kind of annoyed. That looks way too complicated for me. I can do this. I'm actually getting the hang of this, okay? Despite that first question being a fucking monster, I think I'm actually getting the hang of this. I expected myself to be so much worse. I'll probably get all of these wrong when I look back at them and mark them. Let's go to the answers. I got the first question right. I got four marks. I'm actually surprised at that. Didn't get them right, didn't get that right because I couldn't do it. It didn't tell me enough information. So, not my fault. I did it, yay! I got two marks, that's great. Oh, I did it again, oh my God. I'm so proud of myself. The final one, yes! So, I know that it's a grade three subject and you're all probably watching me thinking he's fucking dumb, but I'm proud of that. Because I'm not very independent with maths revision, especially. So the fact that I got like quite a lot on that, I'm quite proud of that. Guys, I got 10 out of 13. That is not bad. That is not, I actually thought this would be worse. That's a breakthrough. I just learned bearings. I can tick that off. Just highlighting that and just like thinking, yeah, I know that. If that doesn't come up on the exam though, I'm going to be very angry. Well, I'm happy with that. I'm not happy with the fact that um, circle theorems are so hard though. That makes me want to die. Let me get this page up. You're probably thinking, oh my god, EJ, this is so easy. Leave me alone. I'm terrible at maths, all right? Are you supposed to learn all of that off by heart before the exam? You can't, is the answer. Not all of us are smart, which is what schools need to understand. Not everyone is smart enough to fit so much information in their brains. That's fucking grade eight. That's one grade away from four marks. You really think I'm capable of that? Because I'm not. I'm going off on a tangent here, so I need to shut up. But... Now is the time when I've finished a topic that I was struggling on. I wait until the buzzer goes off and I check and I'm like, oh, it only has two minutes, I'll just procrastinate the rest of the time. I'm just gonna wait for the buzzer to go off now. 
There it is! Yay! Okay, let me go turn it off. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I think this was actually quite... I won't do these regularly because they're... To be fair, come on. Who wants to watch a random white boy studying for his exams and failing? For real though, I'm leaving in a month, so... Well, okay, I have to go continue studying, which by that I mean procrastinate. I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for motivating me because I was very close to giving up in the middle there. Like, no, I was awful. Thanks for helping me learn a grade three subject. <laughs> and yeah, I'll go back to regular better uploads. I have loads of, right, listen guys, you have no idea, I have loads of ideas. Like, recently I've just had a burst of inspiration, so once my exams are finished, I'm gonna be hitting y'alls with those good vids. That was really cringe, that was cringier than I thought it would be. Yeah. So yeah, please don't give up on me, I promise I'll give you good content soon. Anyone else who's doing their exams this year, good luck to you, uh, we're all in the same boat, so um, yeah. We're all gonna die. Uh, okay. No. So yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, thanks for watching and goodbye.